Hello, everybody, and welcome on back. Man, my glasses are dirty. Let me go ahead and clean them as we do this intro. But uh, welcome on back to another episode of our Let's Play. This is Uncharted 4, episode 13. I might have said the wrong episode last time around. I took your great advice from the previous episode that you guys totally inspired me, and I fixed uh, even some more things with the recordings. Um, Did some color tweaking, some settings tweaking, and now... Nicely enough, um, the way that I have this set up is that if there's any ever kind of crash, I won't ever lose footage. So that's great. <laughs> that's good for me. I'm excited for that. Uh, I also had to do a little bit of research into, because uh, I used DaVinci Resolve, and uh, to see if they, uh, if the program will be able to use, uh, man, my glasses are still dirty. If the program will use MK4 uh, or MKV files. Uh, and turns out, yes, because I was having massive, massive issues a while ago with Adobe with it wasn't accepting MKV. Uh, and I had to convert it and it just added like this whole unnecessary process onto my editing stuff. So uh, more good news for me, essentially. Can I please clean these glasses? Um, I feel like I'm telling like a tell all now with like, you know, that guy who's sitting there on the chair and he's like, uh, I remember back in 1991 when I was born. <laughs> I don't know. Is that better? That's a little bit better. I'll, I'll, I'll clean it a little bit more. But anyway, uh, last episode, uh, we discovered Libertaria, which is the pirate uh, paradise place. And uh, turns out things were uh, not as sweet. Why is my... There we go. Uh, things were not as good as, you know, some people hoped. We found all these bodies and improvised barricades and soldiers fighting colonists. I have a theory. Um, my theory is that basically they came here to be free and have a place to hide away. Then they became a colony. And then the uh, the heads, the founders, became like the rich class and everything and started establishing rules. And the people did not like that because, you know, they came from pirate origins. And they decided to throw a revolt against the founders and like the heads of Libertaria, which is what we're witnessing here. A lot of dead bodies uh and this is all outside what appears to be the treasury and there is this weird flag again or one of these flags i don't know what flag that is where's sam going what's up sam the statue it's like a dog all right well sam's not saying much so let's head on in This is impressive. Uh, Holy. So oh my god, man. Here we go. I was also saying. Oh, you want to give me a hand? Yeah. I was also saying last episode, I don't know how if like Uncharted has ever gone into like the supernatural aspect, but maybe that's what it was. Of course it is. You think Rafe? No. Nothing's been touched in here for hundreds of years. Right. Well, search for clues? Yeah, search for clues. Uh, chapter 15. Thieves of Libertaria. Nothing. I guess we gotta look around for some. Because we blues. Thief. We got him here. Nothing. Hmm. Where the hell did it all go? I mean, there's still a chance that they may Another hit it. Thief. What's this? Oh, we found something. Oh, oh, we manifest. got manifest, manifest. of the good ship Destiny bound for Libertaria from the port of Kings Bay. 10,000 coins silver, 9,000 coins silver, 14,000 coins gold, statue gold horse and rider, 500 pounds, uh, bronze elephant, bronze elephant, 100 spears, 40, 54 cutlasses, 50 cannonballs, 12 horses, 4 barrels of wine. 
Interesting. But I mean, it was profitable. I mean, they were bringing st stuff was coming in. But you know, I'm still running with my theory. Oh, we got this. Found something. Uh, what do we got? This letter still intact. Jewel dagger. A magnificent little specimen painted in indigo with pearl saddle. Details in this sculptured vase are exquisite. So, looks like some sort of just like another. Like, I guess like a, like a log of things that were coming in, like treasure and jewels and Captain stuff. Captain Avery. Oh, yeah. Captain Avery has seen. Uh, certainly seen better days. That's what I was going to say. Hmm. Huh. Fancy clothes. Kind of uniform. Uh, you were a guard here, weren't you? Nice job. Yeah, he died. I, I, I mean, that's obvious. I know that Sam also called us, but I uh, want to see if there's anything else because I'm like, very interested. It's nothing. Gotta be some sort of log. Yeah, there's more thieves, and it's all on the founders. So I, I think I'm uh. Think I'm hey, on Nathan, check it out. What do you got? The battalion money. It says Avery sigil on it. Hmm. Must have melted down the gold, minted his own currency. So based on that, all the manifests on the shelves, the treasure was here. Is the bigger question. Where is it now? Okay. So we know that there was fighting outside. Yeah, Dan inside. What do you think the colonists stole it? No. I think they were trying to reclaim what was theirs. Look. There's Avery. Two. Founders of Libertalia. All marked with the word thief. Not murderer, not tyrant, thief. So by the time the colonists busted in here, the treasure was already gone. Yeah, because these guys had already taken it for themselves. Pirates will be pirates, right? Uh, pirates will be pirates. Huh. I know where they moved it. What? Where? It's a map. Yeah, right there. That's our treasury. It's, it's a map of Libertalia. All right, so follow it to the other side of the island. And look, right there. New Devon. But Avery was from Devon, England. He sure was. Man, those are some seriously large mansions. Each of them has its own sigil, too. Because that's where they lived. You say we uh, climb that watchtower, huh? Get our bearings. New Devon, here we come. Okay, so I was right. I was right. They, they stole the treasure and the people revolted. Now, how do we get up there? Well, I mean, that ledge, but I mean, yeah, how do we... Oh, I see it. Chandelier? <laughs> Idea. You give me a hand with this? Okay. Oh, okay, this side. Okay, ready? Oh, to the side. <laughs> okay, that's step one. Step two. Raise the chandelier. I thought it was left, Good right, idea. left, right, but it was just so whole left. Just take the compliment. <laughs> Now the place is looking classy. Let's get up there. Yeah, but, uh, how? Is it that ledge there? Am I supposed to climb this? Ah. Aha. Oh, 
don't you see if you can swing to that other chain? I... I'm trying, man. Oh, nice one, Tarzan. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, Condon. Baldridge. What? You're stepping on Baldridge. No. Oh, so I am. Uh, Sam and all his cool knowledge of pirates, man. So wait, so I'm a little confused. Does that mean that the treasure is in England? All right. Up we go. Holy I'm really shocked the stairs are intact. Hey, hey, hey. Don't jinx us. I was literally about to say, why would you say anything, Sam? So would that mean that like said. it's in England or there was another location on the island? Nathan, you seeing this tower? Sure am. I feel like I'm missing something here. I'm supposed to give myself some slack. No, no. The weakest knees in the world, man. God fucking Nathan. Uh. Oh, I see it. I see it. I was going about it the wrong way. You Sam? Yeah. All right. Just making sure you haven't plummeted to your death. <laughs> just about there. <laughs> he sure is excited. He is really lift? excited. I mean, I, I mean, this is probably the closest anybody has gotten to like find Come this on. treasure. Ready? Ready. I mean, before this, it was all just like myth and legend, and. All right, I found something. Uh -oh. Stand back. Here you go. Come on. Also, I mean, he's glad that he's not in prison, and you know. Oh, quite the crow's nest, huh? There it is. Just on the other side of the river. Now, what do you say we go? Rob from the rich, huh? Hey, is there a path down there? Uh, of sorts. Come on. So they made Libertaria, and then they made New Devon. And... Uh, how long do you think it'll take us to get to New Devon? Well, a couple hours. Depends on what or who we bump into along the way. Am I climbing down? I can't. I can't see. <laughs> what is this camera angle? Oh! Shit! You all right? Yeah! Come on! Oh my god! Oh my god! Where am I going? Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh -oh. Hell, oh, man. They no, no discretion. Like literally no discretion. Jesus, that was close. Something tells me they've had enough of us. Really? What gives you that idea? Down here, quick! Don't wait, just go. Oh God! Oh my God, dude. Nathan! Nathan! Get up, brother. We gotta go. We gotta go. Now! Oh, 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 oh no. Shit. 
Oh no. Come on, climb. Climb. Esther. Climb, 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 climb. climb. You already said that once. Okay. Oh my god. What is wrong with these guys? Oh my god. Oh my god. Nathan. 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 Kick his ass. Hey Sam, kick his ass. Where am I going? Where the hell am I going? I'm climbing over this way. Where am I going? I honestly, where? That window, obviously. Uh, I don't know where I'm climbing. Oh, there we go. <gasps> Jesus, dude. All right, let's try this again. Okay. I'm inside. I don't want to be inside. I want to go outside. That way. This way. That way. Oh, and Dean. Okay, wait, wait. Hey, Nadine. Great to see you again. Okay, Mango. Mango. What are you on about? Oh, it's my safe word. Are oh, you always this clever? have my moments yes you and your brother have proven yourselves the more capable treasure hunters on the island shame we're not on the same side Wait, there's, there's still time trust a drink i'm not falling for that again hey, hey, just, just let's talk <laughs> Okay, that was a bit rougher than expected. I'll just uh, see myself out. After everything, you think I'm just going to let you walk away? That'd be the wise thing to do. Oh, come on, Nadine, really? We know you're a badass and all, but there's two of us. I don't think my men are on their way here right now. All I have to do is buy some time. That's if I don't finish it myself. God damn it. Oh, it's a fist go! fight. Oh, God. I forget how to fight with this. Oh, ow, ow. I'm tired of silence. I'm tired of your brother. And I'm tired of you. Sam, oh, I know you don't. Get go! She is bad as Talk about this bitch. I don't think so. Oh my god. Sam, he's like, hold on a second. Almost comedic, man. 
the gun. Oh, ow. You're fast, but you're not that fast. Hey, forget about her. Come on, we gotta get out of here before they... Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Everybody just... just calm down, okay? Well, this is interesting. Nate? Samuel? Put your guns down! All of you! No. Rafe, this guy's on edge. Oh, don't worry about him, Nadine. These guys don't kill anyone in cold blood. It's just not their style. You wanted to bet her life on that? Go ahead, then. Shoot her. Sam. I die, you both die. So be it. Not another step! I mean... like this? Sam, put the gun down. I warned you. Do it! Rafe! It's done! Hold your fire! Don't shoot! Put it down. It's done. Okay? It's done. Don't worry, Nadine. It's not their style. I say, I didn't think he had it in him. <laughs> Samuel. You okay? I guess you knew this moment was coming, huh? Hey! Come on, man. You already got us. Take it easy. Come on, now you're a businessman. Let's just, just work out a deal. Oh, a deal? Oh, yeah. Love to hear what you have in mind. Oh, you can go ahead. I'm listening. I just. I... You want to find Avery's treasure? We'll help you find it. And in exchange, I let you live? Yeah. That and a small cut. <laughs> the gauchos on this guy. Just enough to get him his freedom, okay? His freedom? Nathan. Yeah. He did hard time. Our time. And the guy who broke him out, Hector Alcazar, he owes him a lot of money. Whoa. What the hell are you talking about, Nate? Hector Alcazar died in a shootout in Argentina like six months ago. I'm the one that got Samuel out. Oh. Wow. What did he tell you? Sam, what kind of story did you cook up? Alcazar? Really? You lied? You lied to your baby brother? We're wasting time! Just a second. Thing is, Nate, I never stopped looking for Avery's treasure. I just kept running into these dead ends. <laughs> and then I hear that our dear old Samuel Drake, an authority on Avery, is alive and somewhat well. There was no breakout. I bribed the prison warden, and your brother, he just waltzed right out the front gate. He spent the last two years tracking down a second St. Dismas Cross. You know what? He did it all with me. Uh, oh, yeah? No, that's bullshit. Oh. Sam, care to refute? Nate. Oh, Sam. Jesus, no, no. Listen, Avery's treasure was ours. It was always ours. I left my light for you. <laughs> hey, look, look, Nate, if it's any consolation, he duped me too. He pulled a Houdini on me, he brought you. And that old man back into the mix, and I cannot lie, Sam, that really pissed me off. But, <clears throat> all behind us now. You don't deserve it. You do? Last I checked, we're all a bunch of thieves digging around where we shouldn't. Rafe? What? One way or another, end it. Or I will. Well, you heard the lady. Hey, you missed one clue, and you can kiss that treasure goodbye. You said it yourself, keep running into dead ends. Why don't you face it, Rafe? You need us. No, you're right. You're half right. I just need Sam. Wait, now you're making a mistake. Don't, don't, you don't, don't listen. 
Nate! Hey! Nate! There it is. Who the hell lives here anyway? I don't know, no idea. But this is definitely the address. Been scoping the place out for the past few days. No one's home. <sighs> and here we are. Whoa. This place is humongous. <laughs> Where do we even start? Start by finding a That's way. That's what in. she said. Sorry, my and microphone was muted. <laughs> wow. I was not. I, I knew there was something up with Sam. I was I saying that he was going to get, alarm. like, kidnapped. Let's try and find a way or something. Breaking a window. But uh, I was not seeing that betrayal happen. Ooh, got chilly all of a sudden. You want your jacket back? No, 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 no. Just got to keep moving. Got to keep moving. Here we go. Let's look around back, huh? Looking around back, Broder. Also, is there a run button? I don't even know if there's a run button or not. Oh, okay. Okay. Give me your hand. I got you. I got you, bro. Even though you betrayed me, and I know this is a flashback. There you go. I can't jump that high. Well, wait, we can do that. Follow me. There we go. Ah, the old, we left the window open, eh? Come on, Nathan. Wow. Spooky. Oh, here. I brought a spare. Again, these these L-shaped flashlights. I want so, one. So, are we looking for any particular room? Uh, just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? Uh, what do we got here? A box. Oh, there's a canteen. Nothing in here. And some shoes, some dusty. Those are some real gross shoes, man. Books, papers. Uh, Miss Evelyn, my name is Kenitro Namba. I recently attended your lecture at Adventurer's Lodge last week regarding your recent find, the set of Tokugawa era armor you obtained on the coast of Okinawa. Uh, your presentation was utterly fascinating, although I was surprised by the condescending tone of the questions from the audience. I believe recognition and respect for one's work should not be contingent on race or gender. I imagine we both have struggled in that regard. I write today because I have come into possession of what I believe to be French jousting armor. Though I am not completely certain the date nor the country of origin. If you have any time to spare, it would greatly appreciate the insight of someone with your expertise. I apologize if this is too forward, but I only will be in the city for another month in September. I traveled to Iceland to study a Viking burial site and would deeply regret missing the opportunity to speak with you further. I'm staying at the uh, Lennox. If you wish to contact me, I sincerely hope you do. Kindest regards, Kenichiro Namba. Interesting. I feel like there was more to that note. Because it said I could flip it and there was a paper clip on it. Oh, there's another box over here. A sleeping bag. Nope. Nah, it's not going to be in this attic. Boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. I mean, those, those are books. Are you not going to check those books out? Nope. We're going to go inside the house. Further the B and E. Down we go. Wait. We. Oh. So, you... how do we find them? What, Mom's notebook. I mean, don't you remember? She always used that off-white leather binding. Yeah, I know, but oh. it's such a large place. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. This is their parents' house. Oh. Here we go. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? 
Relics no. of. It's not one of mom's. You got that the right is. idea, though. Definitely not. It's in here. Uh, this is creepy. Eddie, greetings from Peru. I hope my letters arrive safely. There is no post office here, only a small patch of grass serving as a runway and slow boats up the Manu River. I wish you could have seen the howler monkeys yesterday. Bright orange creatures with expensive, uh, expressive faces and ample curiosity. I would not describe the noise they make as a howl. However, it is more like a hurricane wind mixed with a lion's roar. Were it, uh, were it not illegal and dangerous, I would bring home one for you as a pet. Ram is busy, uh, busy with herself in preparations for tomorrow's excursion into the jungle where I hope we conclude our research. She sends her love. I promise when you are older, we shall bring you on our trips. Uh, so you might experience the larger world for yourself. Be a good for grandma, study hard, and we shall see you both in a month, dad. Was this your house? I, I don't know. Hey, this these boxes remind you of anything? Every place we ever lived. Exactly. I remember Dad was always like, why bother unpacking? We're just going to move again in a month. Yep. Always the asshole. Hey, Sam. Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Rich people? <laughs> Explorer? Uh, we'll budge. Here, let's do it together. You ready? Bush! A sarcophagus? What the hell? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Sarco yeah, I don't know what the plural is for <laughs> sarcophagus. Sam. This is real. What is this place? Huh? Let's go find out. <laughs> I don't know, man. It's it's weird. Huh. This one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. That's an Iron Maiden. Hmm. Hey, you recognize that one? Uh. I, I, I've seen something like it before. Reclining figures. It's Etruscan. Uh, that's, that's the gross. armor. Yeah. Husband and wife. And buried together. That's kind of romantic. Kind of dark. Dark, but romantic, I guess. <laughs> yeah. This place is like a damn museum. <laughs> Think they've got a dinosaur wing? It wouldn't surprise me. Uh... I don't know what's up these stairs. Oh, a toy plane! Wow, it's one of those that land on the water. I love those kind of planes. Well, I don't want to deep dive, like deep, deep, dig deeper, and like you know, uh, what you call it. You know, I, I'm already like drawn into the story and everything, but. I think this is a perfect place to end this episode off. Um, we're getting close to the end of the game. If I'm not mistaken, there's only 22 chapters, and I think this was 16. So we're getting pretty... 16 or 17, so I think we're getting pretty close. Actually, I can double-check that. Save. 16! So we are getting pretty, pretty darn close, but uh, I am loving this game. It is so, so good. I love it. <laughs> I really, really do. It's very, very good. Um, but we're going to go ahead and end this episode here, but thank you everybody so much for watching and checking this episode out. Let me know what you thought about this episode in the comments. If you have any questions or concerns, I'll give you guys an update on the next episode, how the recording went and everything. Cause I'm going to go ahead and pop this on out and over on DaVinci Resolve and see how easy it is to edit it out and, and everything and see if it, you know, makes any difference or anything like that. So um, but thank you. Thank you for the inspiration last episode because I was like, I don't want to ever lose any footage. And now I figured out how not to. So that's cool. Uh, also do all the things like comment, subscribe, hit the bell icon. So that way, you know, when we have a new video that goes live on our channel, we post pretty frequently on our channel Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays with uh, 
some different types of videos that we do here. And if you do like watching me here, you can go ahead and check me out over on Twitch. I stream every Monday, Tuesday, Friday, 7 p.m. EST, and on Sundays at 2. Um, so uh, thank you again so much for watching. And until next time, guys, gals, and pals, bye-bye. <laughs>